understand you have a story to tell, ma'am. Would you like to tell your story to the world? My story was day before yesterday. Everything was fine. I thought, you know, I was getting things straightened out with my bank. What bank was that, ma'am? Chase Bank. Chase Bank. Oh, they're big. Yeah, they're real big. And you would think that they would be able to do a little more than what they're doing to help a person with the problem. What's the problem? The problem is, is that I was overdrawn in my account for quite a while after losing my job, losing my car, and practically being homeless on the street. Chase Bank gives a customer 60 days to uh, clear up their account. In well, writing? Yes, it's in writing. It's in the fine print. Oh, was that in their brochure? Probably. Anyway, mm -hmm. I came in on the 59th day, or at the worst case scenario, maybe the 60th day, but before the close of business, I was there when they opened their doors up. How many fees did they charge you while you were uh, overdrawn? Because you had lost your job? Like 20? I don't know. A lot. But it was like $1,000, right? Yeah, they said that they had... And how much did they give you back? Only $34. But... Oh, isn't that impressive? So, anyway, when I left the bank that morning, I had gotten a sum of money into my account that cleared up the overdraft fees, plus I still had over $1,200 in my account. They also gave me credit of $34 for some of those overdraft fees, which I felt like they should have given me more. Anyway, they didn't, so I'm moving on. I walk out of the bank, everything's fine. I start paying some of my bills because it's greatly needed and find that around, I don't know, today I guess it was, which is the 27th, when I went to use my card, I my card wouldn't work. So I come home, I get on the phone, and I'm told, told that my account was shut down. 